So they took maybe 20 bucks and an old watch? Mr. Madsen, would you even take a swing? No. Could have taken her, Dad. Heard you had some excitement last night. I wish they'd have picked my place, you know? Why didn't you take him out? I was just trying to keep the damage to a minimum. Yeah, how's that working out for you? You okay? Because you don't look okay. Bob, how are you today? I'm good. Where are you at in Ireland, Rory? I'm working out of Dublin, out of my home. Can't leave because of all this. Uh, how are you? I'm great. I'm great. I'm in L.A. Fantastic. First of all, um, I consider, I, I think nobody is going to end up becoming one of my ultimate Friday night movies. I had so much fun watching it. Uh, and it's, it's a, a specific kind of fun that I do consider a Friday night movie. But I'm curious, yeah. what yeah. would Bob Odenkirk consider to be one of his favorite Friday night movies? Uh, I know exactly what you mean. And I would say uh, Hard Boiled. Oh. Uh, I like watching, I've watched Police Story by Jackie Chan a number of times. Fantastic. Uh, probably my favorite action film is Police Story. Um, Zelig. I know it's not popular to reference Woody Allen movies these days, but it's a great, funny movie, Zelig. And Animal House. Oh, you sure. Know, it's of course. a great movie. It really yeah. is funny and awesome. Yeah, yeah there's, there's, there's something about this kind of movie where it automatically puts you in a good mood when you're, when you're watching it. Um, and I have to say that the, the kind of the first big fight scene on the bus was phenomenal. Absolutely brilliant. But um, I, I'm wondering how, I, I know you obviously got very prepped for, for a film like this because yeah. you have to, it's so physical. Was there, was there a point or any particular stunt where you're like, I want to do that, but I'm not sure if I should go full Tom Cruise on this? Yeah, um, I wanted to do my own fighting in this. Uh, like I said, Police Story by Jackie Chan is like my favorite action film. And of course he does all his own stunts and fighting. So that's why I trained as long as I did. And I felt fairly confident with the personal one-on-one -on -one fighting because really that's what I trained over and over for. Guns were scary to me, um, especially when the guns had these um, blanks in them that are pretty loud. They're as loud as a bullet if they're a full load. Um, and I even got like ringing in my ears from them. And they just scare me. Guns are sure. just, you got to respect guns. You got to be careful around them and Absolutely. show them great respect. So honestly, it was working with the guns, working with the blanks. Uh, when I had to hold the gun close to someone's head, I mean, that kind of thing scares me because those blanks even have power, you know? Yeah. But uh, the actual fighting, I love doing it. And I even love to do, to push the limits and try to do things that might hurt me. I did not, oh, I don't want to wreck the movie. I mean, I think I know what you're going to say. Does it still involve the bus? Yeah. Yeah, I, I think I know. That's not me. Sure. I, I figured that might not be you. And but... if you notice, if you want, next time you see that, watch that his leg gets caught on the window. I did. I did. Because I even watching, I was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> A little bit when I see that. It. was intense. I'm some... trying to have a limp when I walk away. Yeah. Uh, that was, I, I never even, yes, I never, I never clocked the, the, the connection of the limp. Yeah. Um, but one last one, it does seem to set up a fantastic almost universe for your character. Uh, and just quickly, if, if you'd like, um, would you consider this a one and done? Are you happy you've done this big action movie now? Or if they offered, would you come back for more? Oh, I would definitely come back for more. And the reason why is, and it really was, I wasn't sure, you know, I just wanted to do an action movie. I wanted to give my intensity. I was willing to train. I had these feelings inside me that I felt like, they, they belong in an action movie. Um, but I had so much fun doing that bus sequence. Right. I, did not, I did not think it would be that much fun to do this. But, you know, you train, you choreograph, but then there's all this problem solving you have to do. It's kind of like being in a room full of like a comedy writer's room. It was the closest thing to that where you're, you're, you got to work it out together. And 
I would love to have that experience again. And I'd love to see it again. Bob, thank you so much for your time today. Thank you. There's a long dormant piece of me that so very badly wants out. What are you still doing here, old man? Me? I'm nobody. Nobody! Nobody! Nobody!